1480 News Now, leading you into the future of how you get your news. Local, dependable, on demand. From the 1480 Newsroom, I'm Mike Daniels. Walmart officials say they're banning the two women involved in a fight inside a suburban Indianapolis store that was captured on cell phone video. Walmart announced the step on Tuesday. Police also say they're reviewing the scuffle that happened last Thursday night in Beach Grove. The video was taken by another customer and has gained attention since being posted online. It isn't clear what prompted the women to begin yelling at each other and then start punching and kicking each other on the floor of the store aisle. At one point, a six-year-old boy even hits one of the women with a shampoo bottle. No immediate arrests have been made. The search continues for an 18-year-old man wanted in connection with a shooting death Tuesday in South Bend. Officers with South Bend Police and St. Joseph County Metro Homicide were called to the 2400 block of Fredrickson Street around 5.30 p.m. where they found the victim shot multiple times outside of the home. According to Lt. Dave Wells with St. Joseph County Metro Homicide during a news conference, 21-year-old 20, Jerry Wright was taken to the hospital where he later died. The shooting is believed to have stemmed from a fight according to eyewitnesses who spoke to investigators. Your weather is coming up in 15 seconds. Get the vehicle you want at The Car Company in Warsaw. You'll find more makes, models, colors, and styles of high-quality pre-owned cars, trucks, vans, and SUVs at half the price of new. And now your new full-line Suzuki dealership for motorcycles, ATVs, and scooters. The Car Company on US 30 East in Warsaw. Looking at your Storm Team 16 weather forecast, tonight we may see some showers with a low of 65. Storms are likely tomorrow with a high of 82, and Friday we will see some more rain with a high of 84. A study committee will examine whether Indiana's three-year-old ban on smoking in restaurants and workplaces should expand to cover bars and casinos. House Public Health Chairman Ed Clare supports a comprehensive ban that would include casinos and bars. He does, however, acknowledge that the proposal has had difficulty overcoming projections that a ban would deal a financial blow to the gambling industry. From the 1480 Newsroom, I'm Mike Daniels. Have a great day.